Meanwhile, experts have lauded the Dangote refinery as an initiative that will transform the nation's oil and gas sector. Speaking during an earlier interview with TV360 Nigeria, Diron Fawibe, the group chairman and CEO at International Energy Services Limited, explains that the country has lost millions of revenue to the importation of refined crude. He expressed confidence that in the space of one year, the Dangote refinery will revitalize the oil and gas sector. Today, Nigeria is reporting massively you know, to the Nigeria economy. And to that extent, Nigeria has been spending up to 30, 32% of its foreign exchange earning on imported fuel. Now, I'm not saying that uh, the refinery will go on full stream, you know, when it is commissioned, you know, uh, uh, towards the end of this month. At least, we now see a civil learning at the end of the tunnel, whereby on a gradual basis, within the next one year or so, we, uh, and I've been, I bet it will even be much earlier, that the importation of fuel into the Nigeria economy will stop. I will be able to uptake petroleum products, you know, from this uh, refinery. And if only for the fact that we won't be spending the hard hand foreign exchange on imported fuel. That is a tremendous, it will produce tremendous impact. And don't forget that uh, in the era of uh, no crude oil production that tends to generate foreign exchange earnings for the country. And now that we are now having the, the uh, uh, we now have to stop spending foreign exchange earnings on the imported fuel, that will produce massive effect on the, uh, huge effect on the Nigerian economy. We, we know the, uh, the other effects in terms of ancillary services. Uh, over the past uh, few years, once the refinery construction started, Dangote has been training Nigerians and then providing massive employment for Nigeria. That is the beauty of uh, when we establish strategic uh, project investment in the country.